Cedemos el uso de la palabra al doctor Jamán Dunturé, secretario general de la Unión Internacional de Telecomunicaciones. Your Excellency President uh, Kagame, President of the Republic of uh, Rwanda, and Co-Chairman of the Program Commission, Mr. Secretary of Transport and Communication of uh, Mexico, uh, Mr. Your Excellency the Mayor of uh, Mexico City, uh, my good colleague uh, uh, Irina Bokova, Director General of uh, UNESCO, and uh, my good friend Araslim, hello. Dear friends and colleagues, what a wonderful opportunity for the Broadband Commission to be, be meeting here for the seventh time. Our seventh meeting taking place in this wonderful place. When I remember that when uh, Mr. Carlos Slim invited us back six, seven months ago to the conference to take place here, we could never imagine that we'll be coming and having a new source of re-energizing re re all of the Provan Commissioners. Indeed, this event taking place here in Mexico City today is a testimony of the importance of ICT and particularly of broadband. When we put together this commission, in 2010, it was the objective to help every nation on this planet to have a national broadband plan so that broadband will be accessible to all. Today, there are over 6 billion people, exactly 6.4 billion people, accessing mobile phones. 2.5 billion people are accessing internet. A great achievement has been made, but the challenge is on us to make sure that the remaining 4.5 billion people are connected. Not only connected, but they can benefit from the goodies coming from information and technology and, and communication technology. So that it can benefit from the transition from the information society to the knowledge society. A knowledge society is, is a society where every citizen of this planet can access information in an affordable and secure manner. Where every citizen of this planet can use the information because accessing is enough if you not cannot use it. Where every citizen of this planet can create information as everyone on this planet is a potential source of information. And last but not least, everyone should be able to share information. We are entering the information age, and information is the only thing when you share it, it multiplies. And that's the power of knowledge, which is based on one key ingredient, one key driver human brain. This is one natural resource that is equally distributed everywhere in the world. And I'm very pleased to see that my good friend Carlos Slim and Telmex are putting together these annual events in making sure that the people of Mexico are make, taking benefit of this. We are working together since the creation of the Global Commission in 2010, we have over 100 countries with a national broadband plan. This event today taking place gives us the energy necessary to know to move forward as we know we are on the right track. Sharing the excitement of the people here in this room and in this center. Sharing the wisdom and the, and the vision of the government of Mexico. The new government has, in less than three months, published a new, a new a national broadband policy, which I, as Secretary General of International Telecommunication, 
Union have applauded because indeed it is putting the right environment in place for more competition, for greater, greater usage and greater increase of information and communication technology. Mr. Secretary, you have taken some bold decisions that will trigger the market here and that will give, that will boost the market and trigger more demand. And I believe that the people of Mexico are ready for that. The ex excitement we see in this room is a testimony that indeed Mexico is ready for that. We are fortunate in the Program Commission to be led by two great leaders, one from the industry and a, a great leader from government. President Kagame has shown the leadership in this as showing that being a small country in size has no handicap and is leading the way in his own country in ensuring that every citizen of this country are reaping the benefits of accessing information and communication technology. We are here, the commissioners, 60 commissioners or so, coming from all corners of the world, from Asia, from the Arab world, from Africa, from Europe and the Americas, from Australia. We are here together, united, ensuring that we are going to give our, our energies to make sure that the world we are living in, the world we are preparing for the generation of our children and our children's children is a better place. So thank you very much again for inviting us, for sharing this wonderful excitement with us. I, as Secretary of the International Telecommunication Union, can only be proud to see that the tool that we're dealing with will indeed make a difference and a positive difference in this world. I thank you very much.